Okay, okay, hello, hello everyone, this is Gurusong Gamer and welcome to another video. This time I bring you the Ninja Warriors on the Commodore 64 from 1989. I reviewed this game on the arcade some time ago and I thought it was pretty mediocre, to be honest. But now let's see how it plays on the Commodore 64. So nice music we have had in the background here. I play as this um, red ninja here. And uh, my health bar is down in the right corner. My time limit is down in the left. The amount of throwing stars is up to the left and my points is to up to the right. So this hunchback is pretty difficult. I have to stay away from him. And I should try to duck and jump over. It t takes a lot of damage when they're shooting at me. So I'll it's better to try to learn how to avoid it. Um, so yeah, I may say it's... It plays nice and sounds very good, I must say so. Oh shit, I'm losing a lot of health here. But uh, on the positive side, uh, when I die, I will continue from where I died. So I don't have to start all over. That would have been a nightmare actually. Because it, this is kind of tedious game actually. It's, it drags on and there is not so much variations to it. Um, it's just too long. Um, too long um, um, levels. And without s much of variations. And I'm just screwing up now. Losing health a lot. I should try to at least finish one level. And I can block attacks by holding down the fire button as well. Not like that, now I'm blocking. Yes, I can do that um, by blocking fire actually, I didn't know that. But now I know it. And I think I can change if I want to use blade or throwing star somehow, but I don't re remember. But there are informations, um, there are uh, online manuals that are easy to find if you want to learn the controls and every the plot and everything. In this version there are no introduction to the game, but in the arcade version there were, there were uh, introduction. With the plot and everything. I don't remember it now, but it. I'm fighting against some evil dictatorship or something. Yeah, not playing so good, but never mind, I have not practiced so much. Uh, yeah, so I mean, it can be if with a little bit of practice and if you learn the patterns, how to um, use your jump in the effective way, and um, if you keep your distance to your enemies um, so you don't lose health, it can be a somehow nice experience. But uh, ah, I must say, I'm not very impressed so far. It's this music that is really keep the pleasure up. So it's better to th this hunchback give him a little hit and then Uh, 
um, and um, just try to keep your distance to him. He's pretty strong and you will drag a lot of, enemy, uh, a lot of energy, as you can see. So, so these police officers, they have the same patterns, but it is a little bit difficult when they come in waves attacking you. So. I wonder if I can reach the end of the level sometime today, or if I have to play... Do I have to play this for several days? I don't remember. This is uh, getting a little kind of boring actually now, but... Uh, Oh shit, I forgot. So I wonder if I can uh, meet the, um, the boss somehow soon. Oh, here, here she comes. I believe it's a she actually, I don't remember. And I died immediately. So there you go, I've managed it in the end. And now we have some looting here. I should try to speed it up if it's possible. But I'm gonna wrap it up anyway because we have seen enough of this game. So I must say I'm not very um, impressed by this version, but I think with a little bit of practice uh, it can be a little bit more enjoyable if one learned um, uh, uh, how to use your weapons effectively and if you learn how to avoid enemy firing uh, and keep your health bar at maximum at much time as possible. Um, yeah, I mean, it's, it's just that uh, uh, the the levels drags on too long. Um, that is the main issue with this game. And there are, there are not so much variations to it as well. So it gets, it gets tedious. So there you go. But I'm going to give this a 6 out of 10 anyway. Because I found it more enjoyable than the arcade version. So there you go. Thank you for watching everyone. Have a good one out there and goodbye.